website, so I was thinking of doing like a little update on everything. Um, what? Okay, so this past week we got nibbles. Um, uh, he had gotten sick. I guess he was older than the people at PetSmart said that he was. He was very big for a dwarf hamster being six months old, and they said he was six months old, but, um, he started, like, developing stuff that, um, like, whenever hamsters get old, this happens to them when they're about to die, or whenever this happens, um, and that same thing happened to him, so I think he was much older than they said, um, but I do have Molly still, so that's a good thing. Um, well, my brother's hamster is Molly, and I have her now, so I just thought I'd do a little update, so we don't have nibbles anymore. But, uh, he lived a long and, well, not long, but he lived a happy and rest of his life with me, I would say. Alright, so, so right now I'm just about to clean Molly's cage. You can see she dumped all of her food. It was even more than that. But um, she had put in most of it in her pouches, so that's all that was left. There's that. But um, she's right there, and we'll get started. They're over there getting ready, and I, I just bring the stuff to do this with. Okay. I did this so late at night, um, because I didn't really have time to do it today, um, because we were out at a party, a bridal shower, because my uncle's getting married, and we went to, to, um, his fiance's what, uh, yeah, wedding, bridal shower, whatever, um, so I, this was completely full actually overloaded so she she's eaten that so i'm just going to take everything out of um every at every level sorry i can't talk today okay um there and then um what i normally do down here is actually i just find all of the two toys there's one more carrot but i think it's in her hut let me see if i can find it first before i go Make sure I can see it. So, I can see it in her hole. She made a hole and she, and last night she had her head poked out of it just laying there. That was cute. Okay, so I don't know. Okay. Is there a hole? I don't see it. I can't really ignore that. I can take it. There. That's a bad thing. She's always like whenever I'm trying to do something in her cage because I don't really want to have her out and she is trying to get out and she's out. That's her pee. That's her pee corner right here. Is your pee corner. So I normally like take any of the bedding that's over there and throw that away and replace it um, every other day. Um, today's that day, but I don't have any bedding to replace it with, but I do have a lot of bedding here anyway. Um, here's the other carrot. Okay. She did, or, um, earlier yesterday, um, she had, um, she was emptying her pouches. I could s oh, she, you want the food? Oh, look at the food. Um, she was emptying her pouches, and it's weird because I saw her because she was right there at the hole over there because that's where she puts her food is right there at the hole um that she has made if you can see that um and she it looks like like how she empties her pouches it looks like she's just puking everything out it's really gross but um but anyway so while she was doing that after that she put one of these carrots right up against this the carrot was inside the hut she pushed it up against um the hole so i couldn't see and it was so cute 
is so funny. Okay, so now yeah, just time to clean this. So I'm just going to be using this, and uh, I'll be carrying the camera while I'm vacuuming. It's not gonna really place it down anyway, so it might be a little shaky, but um, just try to show you. Okay, so again, you might not be able to hear me whenever this is going on, but yeah. <laughs> talk while I'm doing this anyway because I didn't even talk that at that time so but if I do say something I don't know if you'll be able to hear me or not um so yeah okay um oops I'll put these two up here they're one of the like little candy chew thingies but they broke in half I accidentally broke one in half and then I accidentally broke the other one in half and now there's just four of them, kind of. So, anyway. She needs to stay down there. The bad thing is, if I move this rope, the, this thing up there, so she can't get on it, she'll still climb up the walls, because that's what she does half the time, anyway. Okay, so now, time for this. Let's see if this works. So, it's like right in the cage. Going in. See if anything happens. Let me get a good, better view of this. <laughs> oh, nothing really happened, dang it. Well, Molly was in the way. Molly, just go in your hut. Go in your hut. Okay, let's go into this. Get you a better view of me cleaning this up, but um, I guess it doesn't really work. Uh, this. this is going down. As you can see, it's like not getting as loud. It's kind of getting a smaller sound or whatever you want to call it. Come on, I need to update. Okay. Yeah, I think that's good enough, and it all falls out. That always happens, like, look, it just all falls out. I think that's because it needs to empty, because it, like, you scoop up, you get up a little bit, and then it needs to empty, so. So I'm trying to scoop it up, so. I like that. Anyway, I'll probably empty it in a second. Okay, so, let me the food. Hopefully she doesn't dump it. And also, um, just while I'm thinking about it, um, you guys, um, if you're looking for, like, more hamsters, to like look at and stuff and dirty pigs and rats and stuff go to um it's a youtuber um i think she is very well known and very popular for like the hamster and kind of like guinea pig and stuff she's popular for all of her stuff her her youtube name or what she calls her channel is piggy pig pigs um she she is, um, I don't really know where she lives, but somewhere, like, where they have, like, a British accent, like, Britain, or, or England, or, you know, one of those places, um, so, if you're looking for more animals, she has, she had four pigs, one of them actually passed away this past, like, month or two ago, um, she got another one, so she still has four, Actually, no, she has six now because she adopted two others. So she has six pigs. Um, she has two hamsters. 
and uh, so many rats. So if you are looking for like someone that has like a whole bunch of animals and they do like updates and a whole bunch of other stuff, um, go to her channel. Um, she's like the best. I watch literally. I watch her videos all the time. Um, right now, actually, at this point, she might not be putting up like a whole bunch of videos because she hasn't done um, a whole bunch of videos this past like two months. But, um, I think that's because uh, she lost, like, one of her guinea pigs and, you know. So, I just, um, you know, try, don't look her up, like, right away, right now. Just, like, give it a couple days or, you know. Um, check up on the channel because her videos are awesome. I really like the, her pigs and her hamsters. I really like her a lot. So, please go check her out for me. Um... So, yes. Okay. So. Okay, well, that's just her her cleanup. I know, uh, okay, people might say that this is a really small cage, but she doesn't like the critter trail cages, and that's all that I have. Um, I can't put her in an aquarium because my mom said no. I can't put her in, um, a con like, an, like a plastic container box thing. My mom said no. Um... So I really don't know what else to put her, her in. She hates the critter trail cages because I actually have two of them. I hooked them up last night for her to live in it. And she just didn't seem like she liked it at all. Like she was just like, wait, where's my old home? And I think she really enjoys this because she literally, she's like a rat. She just like climbs everywhere. She'll, she won't even use the ramps half the time. She'll just climb up here and get up on this, you know. Um, and she really likes this cage because it's just a perfect size for her. Even though that she's energetic, she loves being on the wheel. She doesn't really like like running around and like sniffing stuff. She just likes to run on her wheel a lot. Um, she has a, a big hut. She has two levels and a snack level and a food level with water. Um, and she has like a whole bunch of room. It's like perfect for her because she doesn't need a lot of room. People might say, yeah, they need a lot of room, even if you don't think so. Um, but she really, all she needs is a wheel, and she'll run on that all night. Um, and she just loves to be outside, definitely. So, um, if your hamster is like mine, like, just loves to run on the wheel, doesn't really need a lot of space, just needs a wheel, um, make sure that you have them out at least, like, twice a day. Um, in the ball for a while, or, you know, whatever, I get her out, like, all the time, because whenever she's chewing on the door, that means she wants out, and I'll get her out, um, so I'll do that, I'll do a whole bunch of stuff, I'll take her out, like, practically from 8 o'clock to, like, around when I go to bed, I'll have her in and out, and in and out, and she really likes that, so make sure, if you have, like, a cage like this, I don't really know what it's called, um, but I think it's called All Things Living. It's an All Things Living cage. Um, if you were thinking about getting this for, like, a Syrian hamster or any hamster, really, um, make sure that they don't, that they just really like to run on wheels and they don't need a whole bunch of space because they'll just run on the wheel. Um, this is a perfect cage for you, but still make sure that you do get your hamster out frequently. Um, like I said, I have her out practically all the time, so, unless whenever she's sleeping. At 8, she normally wakes up around 8, um, and then I'll have her in and out and in and out and a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, she'll run on the wheel sometimes around, like, time that you would get home from school. Um, running on the wheel, and then I'll put her back in the cage. She'll normally, like, run on the wheel for a little bit and then go back to bed until 8 o'clock, and she'll come back out and and want to play, so, so yeah, okay, bye, look what she does, hmm. I really like this door too, because it's really long, so she can climb on the whole thing whenever I'm opening the door, like she was just doing, um, so I really like that, okay, so I guess I'll get off here, so, bye.